what is happening what is going on legends hopefully you're doing well hopefully you're having a good day and yeah hopefully enjoy the video what i'm going to do is show you how to create inflated objects in blender it's really easy it's simple so let's jump into it so first thing you want to do is create an object to be inflated so then what you want to do is go shift a mesh cube and then what you want to do is go to tab right click subdivide and let's just add about 50 subdivisions okay then hit tab again we add a sculpt mode bring this here now you want to just click drag it up something like that and then what you can do is go out of tab so right click let's go back to object mode shade smooth and now something you can see it's kind of inflated okay and then what you can do is if you want to do like letters so like text it's actually really easy to make a text so let's go shift a text click on it go to top view so z hit tab and then just write whatever you want so i'm going to write len capitals hit tab again to enter it obviously let's go to geometry then what you can do is go g and just bring it here we center it and then what you can do is just bring this up make it a bit bigger you can see there you can actually bring it a bit more so boom let's make it kind of thick and then just go r x 90 to bring it up like this so we can see it and then what you can do is add a little bit of like depth so click here add a little bit of like roundness basically now click here go to object look for convert and convert it to a mesh then what you want to do is go to modifiers add modifier and search for a remesh and then change this remesh to 0 0.01 Okay, that's perfect and then go here to apply it now what you want to do is go to sculpting just click here and bring this here and look for cloth filler change the gravity to inflate now just do this and there we go look how cool that actually looks and then you can go back to layout and now you can see it's inflated now what you can do is right click shade smooth and then you can always add a another modifier a subdivision surface and just bring it up to two and bring it up too high and this just smooths everything out let's look here boom let's just bring some lighting in and you can throw on a quick material so click here boom if you've got real-time materials throw on something basic boom 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 and it's that easy okay hopefully you enjoyed the video make sure you subscribe and i'll see you in the next video peace